<laughs> that was so appropriate. Guy's name is Nerf Berserker gets murdered by Berserker. <laughs> well, that was easy. We lost MMR zero times playing the sport chat. Zero times. Went all the way from Diamond 60 to Grandmaster Zero playing nothing but gold cheese, hard force, no pivots. Every single game. Uno Mas, potentially. Let's see. This is the worst swap make by M1. Honestly, really trash shop. Once again, quite a trash shop. I guess we could buy like exactly Broom Herb, and it's not that bad. I mean, I guess Broom Sand is okay. I don't know. I feel like our board is so bad if we buy Broom Herb. Quite a bad opener. I think we do buy, well, I don't know. Man, it's just so bad. Like gold is so bad. Like we want to buy the garlic, right? But if we don't buy exactly herb, then like we're pretty weak. But also this thing gets battle rage bag value, so maybe we just buy it anyways. I guess we get to buy coal if you do this. Oh no. I think we just have to buy the garlic. Is that ever worth just put this in the backpack? I guess it's worth it if it rolls exactly blind. Maybe. I don't think so though. I'll we'll just put it in the weapon. Alright, good luck, board. You will definitely need it. Thankfully it's a single weapon power round, so this is an acceptable board state. I don't know if we win, but it's acceptable. Nice. We're almost able to buy a shield. Not that it's particularly good. We use one, but anyhow. On its scale. Have found sale pan and sword. So if we wanted to, we could sell the broom and the hammer. We could just one to one swap them out for these things to still have five gold. Then we could roll once to find and that'd be pretty good. Or even like roll once to find whetstone. I think that sounds correct. One gold garlic is okay. Down to roll again. Not exactly banana and whetstone. So what does that mean the best play is? Is it make sword this turn? It's only turn two, right? Like we don't have the hammer either. So I feel like having the banana is a lot better. And next time we buy this. Thoughts on triple dragon skill, mini color fatigue meme berserker? Like the problem is just getting colors. It's playable, but the problem is hitting colors. There's a bag of rocks. Once again, chat, I just want to say, I think maybe a bag of rocks is a decent way to win, like, turn 6 through 8 on this board with Stilbert. Only once you have Stilbert, of course. But not that troll on that. Because I feel like when I get to keep my hammer or have a random two gold dagger or some shit, it feels pretty impactful. I wonder if this guy's playing. Thank you, Emoji. I don't think we ever beat Guberts and Spike Shield. That does not seem possible. We got three gold more, but we just hold three gold more until the end of time. That's an option. You locked your Gebert by mistake and you should have merged with your sword. Feels bad, man. It do be like that sometimes. I wonder if we're ever buying this 2x2. Two two. We have like 5 gold worth things we could sell, right? So we have exactly Gebert down and sell the orb. I'm kinda down, I guess. I'm not super happy. What's our gold again? We have... Still five. Can't sell unless we hit exactly sell goob. Still down to try, I think. Got exactly morb. Or sorry, uh, herb. Probably just sell this and buy herb. We had our space out of shame. Can't show it to them. Can't show weakness. These things are quite trash. These are not real items. Not real shops. Well, there's the goob. <laughs> yeah, we lost the Shovel Reaper. That's how you know your board fucking sucks. Your board sucks some serious ass if you lose Shovel Reaper. Real terrible. Alright, our board is 
awful. I think we are in the, the spot of needing to click Max and <laughs> not die. This is most definitely the worst board of all time. What's wrong with Shovel? Everything. Everything is what's wrong with Shovel. What isn't wrong with Shovel is the easier question to answer. Streamer, where is your pumpkin? You need a pumpkin? Do we need a pumpkin? I don't think we do, do we? I'll take three gold morb since we're playing this. We have already sold a three gold morb. We'll buy a three gold morb back. Alright, thankfully we queued into more Garbanzo like ourselves. Feels good, man. We can buy a bloob just to be a trigger. It's pretty okay. Helps us get into a scale as well. There's a Valor. We definitely have to buy that. There we go. You love this game? Smile, me too. We got more garlic. Neat. I guess in theory having this in the board doesn't do nothing. We'll put it in the board. It doesn't do anything though. Let's be honest. <laughs> I think this guy can't ever out DPS since, since he does not have Stilbert, right? He might win if he had Stilbert, but I don't think he can ever win without the, without the Stilberts. Alright, click our knuckle every time. We are probably still on the herb. Board lacks a lot of cheese, kind of true. It do be lacking in cheese. It do be making up for the cheese and moon shield. There is another three gold morb. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. Uh, we're just going to lock that and keep rolling. I think we might lose this one shot. That's my guess. Now, if we get cheese before we find the stand pot, we might not lose. But if we don't find any cheese, I think we're going to die. Like, we're definitely fine to just sit on Axe and Moon Shield and stuff for a couple turns and just have that be our board. But if we find the Stand Pot too early and don't have cheese, we're gonna be really sad. We have found Infinity Morbs. That is not what we're looking for. We've literally seen like seven fucking Morbs. <laughs> so many. Bye, Collie. This isn't grilled cheese, I know. Ridiculous. There's no stand pot yet. There's also no cheese. How are we supposed to have grilled cheese, no stand pot, no cheese? Do you actually lose this combat with the moon shield? No way, right? Yeah, no way. Kill him. Easy. We have found the umpteen thousandth morb. No thanks. I don't want your stinky morb. I should buy this 2x2, two two, I think. We have found 7 trillion morbs. <laughs> I can't use all these fucking morbs. Bruh. We have found nothing but morb over and over. <laughs> Why do you keep offering me morbs, dude? I don't need these. Alright, well, I think we're done this game shot. That's okay. We've gone like 15 games in a row or 20 games in a row without ever losing, so. I'm sure you're probably supposed to lose in the roll. All good. I don't think we ever beat this, right? Surely not. Yeah, it's like maybe two swings away, maybe. All right, we got the stand pot. We have no cheese. It's okay. We send it. Send it every time. Complete faith in cheese. Cheese. I believed. Cheese has come home, Carius. We also didn't ever find second valor yet. That's kind of bad too. 
<laughs> There's a lot of very bad things happening right now. Don't think there's ever a world where this is looking any different than this, right? Or at least substantially different. No, not, not, not quite true. Let me do this. How do we fix you? I think you go sideways, how we fix you. Mm, not quite. There we go. We do this. Yeah, there you go. Alright, that is highest win odds. Although, maybe we should do that instead. Yeah. Alright, good luck, board. You're a turbo shot. I don't think it's ever beaten us, right? I think we'd like literally lose to just the back of rocks. <laughs> All good. The grandma stream? Hell nah. We get GM and we just piece the fuck out of here. Ain't no way we're playing the grandma. Alright, let's flip this so it's the normal orientation. Grandma is way too much annoyance. Like games like this, you know, where you're like one life on 12 just because nothing has appeared in your shop of, of merits. Those games make me not want to play the game if I'm trying to play for rank. So, therefore, we don't play for rank and we instead play for games that are fun. It is much more fun to not play for rank. You get Jamie playing Chili? Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I want to play yet. I'm not that opposed to buying the Holy here, Chuck. Try Fatigue? I might try some Fatigue, yeah. The thing is, I think we lose the round unless we find cheese. That's the problem. Even just like one by two food trigger, like more garlic is pretty okay. Also, Valor is probably like the very best of it. Okay, well, now we have the option of Valor. <laughs> We've spoken the Valor into existence. Did we, in fact, actually want the Valor? Unclear. Let's see. So we'd be doing this, right? So is that good? This turn. Let's see. We figured out last game that this is what we're trying to do to make these morbs better, right? Yeah, it's that. Okay, that is probably the best thing we can do this turn, right? We click the Valor. I think we're down to sell the colors so we can roll for cheese. There's a 7 gold holy. I don't think so. I think it's gotta be cheese. Alright, well, good luck, board. This is the best possible configuration. He only has melee weapons, so I think we automatically win. If we found a cheese next turn, I think we're in a pretty good spot. I need to spend cheese. Cheese is the best item in the whole board. Gives you everything you need. Gives you health, gives you damage. Gives you everything. It might just be a buy garlic angle here. Also, this looks turbo scuffed, doesn't it? It's fucking stam socks, this fanny pack here. It's so perfect though. It's actually like as good as it could possibly be. Really don't want to buy that. That's trash. Alright, well, let's come back. I'm lucky. I still don't want to buy it. We can just swap out our garlic for it. Looks like you built from your last YouTube video. Yes. We're getting a GM with this build. That is the plan, at least. Unclear if the board has other plans, but that is my plan. Alright, well, good luck. You're gonna need it. Okay, we may have found the worst board of all time. Nice. Imagine we lose to this in Hotshot. I'll be so upset if he lost this. <laughs> Fucking double misfortune, vamp glove, vamp goob, double hungry blade reaper. I don't think it's even like a little close to being able to lose to it. He has no luck somehow. Yeah. Also, I love how this guy's name is Nerf Berserker. <laughs> that is so appropriate. Guy's name is Nerf Berserker gets murdered by Berserker. <laughs> <laughs> what do the giraffes do? They print the buff that he has the most of, if he has luck. He does not have enough luck gen for them though, not even close. Cannot ever use crown. Our shops this game are just... definitely not it. 
never seen the giraffes? There's a reason for that. Oh, where? The giraffes. Oh man, I really hope we don't die to this. He has no toss poker though, right? So I don't think we can lose to it. Should be impossible. Yeah, the toss poker, I think we might be able to lose, but usually they just get slapped for like 100 around the time they lamp. Oh wait. Oh. Wait, please. Please. Okay, cool. All good. No problem. Never worried. I realized that Lamb does actually produce spikes after I said it. He doesn't have Tusk Poker. Clueless. <laughs> Thinking that that mattered. Yeah, the spike jump is a little slow. It's one banana required to be stamp stable. It's, uh, basically there's just too many boards like this. So yes, for the most part. There's too many boards like me that have these, this exact same setup. And you can't beat those boards in a long fight. And it's always a long fight. I really don't want to buy the stem sock. I can buy you because you're free. There's cheese! Get that out of my board. Nice. Alright, I think we have stabilized and won the game. Unless we explode to a pyro or a ranger right here, which we just queued into ranger, so it has to be exactly pyro, which I don't think we can lose to. And we're chilling. Stop mana, one better one spot left. Yeah, I think it actually is. It's a good point. I had it here for the combined turns, but I forgot that we already done all the combined turns. I just never moved it back. Very nice. And Slamp Ranger beat this. You buy cop and you can't lose. <laughs> you kill him quickly enough and they honk out. Interesting looking power board. Yeah, for real, huh? Interesting power board he has there. Uh, we could buy gems and try and hit Topaz, I guess, if we want to. It's pretty bad though. It's like exactly Topaz. Stamina or St Sapphire is like okay, I guess. Ruby's okay. Yeah, we have enough good hits. That's fine. There's Cap. We just roll twice and see if he hits. There's Ruby. Could just sell it right now. Just say we get the Ruby and we just get the fuck out. If we're really scared about losing, we can do that. I think I'll just sell this though. Alright, well, there's Pyro Board that we have Cap for. Feels good, man. Therefore, we just automatically win. Although, I think we would want even without Cap. Poison do be quite trash against this board. He had three strong pestilence spots, just weren't connected. Are you serious? Well, I'm glad that I didn't like the board. We got fourth cheese and a sail bird. Sick. We also got a sapphire. Dope. I'll just put it in armor for defense. Might be ranger, right? Is there a way that we can play this Gucci bag? I mean, technically, there's three spaces in the board, right? So that implies that there is a way to put in the bird. I don't know that I care enough to try and figure out what that is. Although I think that there's just a way over here, right? Yeah, that's fine. We can do that. Oh, we found another Excal. This is a Deer Scal. Historically, we have never lost this matchup. I don't think it'll, we're going to start now. That is trash board. We even beat him one time when we had two cheese and they had four cheese. We still won. Because Knuckle Scaling is just too good. This guy only has one color too. A bunch of random bullshit, so. Should definitely lose. I'd be surprised to not lose. Or surprised to not win. The numbers do be going burr. 100 plus fatigue? Nah. Nah, 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 nah. We deal way too much damage to that. He dies way too quick. Ruby and Scal is pretty fine. There's more cap. Uh, I mean, I guess we could upgrade a Ruby if we want to. How good is Bird for this board? It's okay. It's just okay, though. Well, I guess we'll do this. We can roll one more time. Or wait, not. I lied. Alright, we're done then. Let's send me. So when we're good here, it's good, yeah. You can get to, like, 20 plus starting mana with it. That's pretty fine. Definitely if I found the so Holy before I found the uh, Valor, I'd be down to buy it. Or if I had like too many turns consecutively where I didn't have anything to buy, I need to spend money somehow, I'd definitely be down to buy it and make it. It's definitely fine. What you can do is if you get Moon Armor and Moon Shield and one Stone Cap or Stone Skin, you can instantly get 11 mana as sort of combats. Everything on this except the duration is additive. That's how stacking caps works. This guy's board looked kind of bad, no? It's very weak for 18. He doesn't even have maxed out flames in this thing. Where did your money go, brother? Why are you so poor? You don't even have two dragons. 
This guy's like 30 gold below where he should be, I feel. Maybe even like 40 or 50 gold. How odd. Oh, wow. We got it. Holy shit. I did not think this game was going to be a plus six. Well, hell yeah. Easy. Grilled Cheese Grandmaster. We lost MMR zero times playing the sport chat. Zero times. Went all the way from Diamond 60 to Grandmaster Zero playing nothing but Grilled Cheese, Hard Force, No Pivots. Every single game. Grand Grilled Cheese Master.